this following video, if you are struggling to choose between a Tibetan Mastiff, also known as Dakai, and an American Pit Bull Terrier also known as Pit Bull, we've compiled all the detailed information you need to know to help you make the best choice. So let's begin the fight. Intimidation Factor The Tibetan Mastiff's defining features are its lion-like mane and massive stature. An adult male Tibetan Mastiff stands at a height of 26 to 28 inches at the withers, and weighs between 45 to 72 kilograms. They are massive, well-built, athletic dogs that boasts having thickish, long double coats with an extremely bushy tail. Whereas an adult male American Pit Bull Terrier stands at a height of 18 to 21 inches at the withers, and weighs between 16 to 27 kilograms. Their physical appearance shows strength, power, and passion. They are powerful for their size and are incredibly light, athletic, and speedy dogs. However, in terms of intimidation, a Tibetan Mastiff have got all the hallmarks of an intimidating breed as compared to a Pit Bull. So one point to Tibetan Mastiff. Tibetan Mastiff 1 Pit Bull 0 Powerful and loudest bark? Let's hear it first and we'll decide accordingly. <coughs> In our opinion a Tibetan Mastiff has a powerful bark, so one point to Tibetan Mastiff. Tibetan Mastiff 2 Pitbull 0 Bite Force Among the two, the Pitbull pressure bite top 235 psi, whereas in case of a Tibetan Mastiff, we didn't have any information with respect to its bite force. However in our opinion, considering the dog breeds with similar cranial dimensions, we estimate it could be in between 500 to 700 psi. So one point to Tibetan Mastiff. Tibetan Mastiff 3 Pitbull 0 Powerful Guard Dog Among the two, a Tibetan Mastiff is extremely ferocious and a powerful guard dog. So one point to Tibetan Mastiff. Tibetan Mastiff 4 Pitbull 0 Temperament The Pitbulls were originally bred to be aggressive since it was a dog used in blood sports. But today's Pitbull breed are no longer fighters or workers. Instead Instead, they are friendly, intelligent, loyal and strong-nerved, whereas the Tibetan Mastiffs are known to be reliable, trustworthy, loyal and they form strong bonds with their families becoming totally devoted to them. They boast having a strong protective instinct, although they are gentle and affectionate by nature too. However as per the American Temperament Test Society, Pitbulls were the second most tolerant dogs in the US after the Labradors. Considering this fact, one point to Pitbull. Tibetan Mastiff 4 Pitbull 1. Lifespan. The average life expectancy of a Tibetan Mastiff is in between 9 to 15 years and that of a Pitbull is in between 12 to 15 years. So one point to Pitbull. Tibetan Mastiff 4 Pitbull 2. Exercise and energy levels. Both the breeds are high maintenance dogs in the exercise department, and ideally need to be taken out for a walk, a minimum of twice a day for a good hour each time. However in terms of energy levels, a pit bull is far more energetic as compared to a Tibetan Mastiff. So one point the pit bull. Tibetan Mastiff 4 Pit Bull 3. Friendly with kids and other pets. Both the breeds are known to be good around children of all ages because they are so calm and patient, more especially if they are well bred, even tempered dogs. In case of other dogs and pets, both the dogs can show aggression which is why it's important they be introduced to each other slowly and carefully to make sure things go smoothly. So one point to both. Tibetan Mastiff 5 Pit Bull 4. So the winner between the two dogs is the Tibetan Mastiff. 